Maria. I can't say that I'm honored to be here today because it's very troubling that we have to be here in protest on a war that most Americans know should end and that the president refuses to hear the cry of most of America, especially when so many of our, our young people are being permanently injured and, and being killed. But what I'd really like to say is that for anyone who's serious or gives lip, lip service to claiming that they want to end the war and that we should bring the troops home, it's politically schizophrenic to say that you want to bring the troops home, that you want to end the war, and then send 1,300 new troops from Maryland to Iraq, especially when we have so many problems right here in Maryland and, and in Baltimore City. Earlier this year, um, I wrote a statement that Baltimore had more homicides than Baghdad. Um, and so I would just urge my fellow Democrats in the state house, in the legislature, in the city council, the uh, mayor Dixon and Governor O'Malley to put their actions where their mouths are. If they really want to end the war, take the steps necessary to do it. Now, and Delegate Carter, how do you feel about the fact that the Democrats, at least the two state senators in this in our in our state, are continuing to vote to fund the war? Talking about Mikulski and uh, Cardin, how do you feel about that? I think it's, it's I think it's the wrong thing to do. I think that I understand the the explanations and the excuses, but I think again it's political schizophrenia to claim you want to end the war, you want to bring the troops home, and then continue to support it. And so I think it's the wrong way to go. And and they need and and they need to hear this message from the people. Uh, anything else? I I feel that's for now. Um, I just want to note that you know we've got the symbolic coffin here and that we're about to take a march. We are marching to the National Guard, National Armory. Guard Armory. We are. And um, we certainly want, thank you for being here. We welcome everybody to join us. Okay, thank you very much.